hello guys welcome to the video in this video we'll be designing a three-step parapet for one of our building projects which we have built in 2025 so this estimate can also be applied if you're designing a two-step parapet or a one-step parapet and also if you're wondering between the bodied parapet and the hanging parapet which one is cost saving then do yourself good as you sit tight and get the detailed information and the materials bought for our three-step parapet for this building which is measuring 17 meters by 18 meters so far for the starting of this parapet we bought 80 pieces of 1 by 12 wood at the rate of 360,000 naira. We have bought a 2 by 2 wood that is 100 pieces of it at 1,700 naira, which gave us 170,000 naira. We bought 100 pieces of 1 by 6 wood. When you buy this 1 by 6 wood, it's actually 50 pieces of 1 by 12 that the pieces to give you this uh, 100 pieces. So we also bought 100 pieces of 1 by 5 which they pieces 50 pieces of 1 by 12 to give us 225,000 naira we bought 100 pieces of 1 by 4 and the pieces 33 pieces of 1 by 12 to give us 148,500 naira we bought one roll of binding wire at the rate of 30,000 naira we bought 60 length of the 12 mm rod at the rate of 9,500 naira, which gave us 570,000 naira. 25 length of 8 mm rods were bought at the rate of 8,000 naira, which gave us 200,000 naira. We also bought 6 inches nails for our scaffold, where the carpenter can work and also use it to do plastering. We also bought one bag of 2 inches nails for 5,000 naira. One bag of three inches nails at forty-five thousand naira. We bought fifty-five bags of cement for the total casting of this parapet at the rate of ten thousand naira, which gave us five hundred and fifty thousand naira. We bought one water tank at the rate of forty-five thousand naira, which we use to pour this building parapet. So for the dressing of this parapet, we paid. 600,000 naira to dress this parapet. We also bought bamboo 150 pieces at the rate of 1,000 naira per one, and then we paid 150k for this. So the total cost for the material and the labor as we have spent, the labor cost is 1.3 million naira and then the total cost for the labor and the material is 4,708,500 naira so the difference between the bodied parapet and the hanging parapet is that the pieces of wood for the the pieces of wood for the hanging parapet will not have been that much we would have bought only pieces of wood for the beam alone and and the rest is just to hang the parapet up and they would all have paid 600k extra for the hand for the dressing of this parapet but for the hanging parapet the the cost of cement for doing that will go high given that they have to mold it and then pour the parapet itself including the beam so this is the estimate for the hanging parapet if we were to do the hanging parapet this is how much we are going to spend we would have bought two rows of binding wire at 60,000 naira 30 lengths of 12 mm rods at 285,000 naira 25 lengths of 8 mm rod at 200,000 naira we would have bought uh, the 6 inches nails at the rate of 45,000 naira, 2 inches nails at 45,000 naira, 3 inches nails at 45,000 naira, and then 
85 bags of cement for the molding and the pouring of the parapet at the rate of 850,000 naira. We would have bought two big uh, GP tank water, like two tanks for the molding and the pouring of the parapet at the rate of 90,000 naira. And then the parapet molder would have charged us 700,000 naira to mold this parapet and hang it up. So the labor we should have used for the carpenter, the scaffold, the iron bender, and the people who are going to pour this, the beam and the parapet, um, supervision, everything will be have been at the rate of 1 million naira. And then uh, the bamboo for scaffold, because this one, you need to stand on the scaffold to hang it. So it would have been 150,000 naira. So a total of three million four hundred and twenty five thousand naira will have been projected for the hanging parapet instead of a total of four million seven hundred and eight thousand five hundred that we have spent on this three-step parapet so that's the difference between the hanging parapet and the boarded parapet so if you have been having this debate, at least uh, this will give you an idea about it. So I'm not talking about the strongest between the two. I'm talk talking about the price difference between the two. So if you found this video useful, kindly like the video and subscribe. Also share to people who are planning to do parapet so that they know the breakdown and how much it's actually going to cost them between the two. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day and God bless you. Bye-bye.